Hey everyone, Lauren Petrelli here and we are continuing our weather experiments to help keep the kids learning while they're at home from school. So we've had plenty of days of sunshine here in Southwest Florida, but with some rain on the way, I thought we could make our own rain gauge and then put our numbers to the test. So let's get started. You'll need a few household items like a tape measure or ruler, a plastic bottle, scissors, and a permanent marker. You'll want to cut the top off of your plastic bottle, but make sure you keep it even. Then fill your plastic bottle with pebbles or sand to make sure the bottom of the bottle is completely even for accurate readings. And finally, use your ruler or tape measure to make a scale along the bottle side. You can even compare your numbers to other registered rain gauges in our area through sites like Weather Underground. All right, and the only thing left to do is to put your rain gauge outside. Make sure you put it in a wide open space. If you put it up against the house, plus we have any wind during the rain, it could really skew the numbers. I made a second rain gauge out of a vase I had at home. It has a flat bottom. I added my numbers to it. This is another easy and simple way. Don't forget to head over to the Fox 4 social media pages to share your rain gauge with us too. Back to you. 